All right, time for another update. Sorry if I sound out of breath. I've been doing a lot and moving a bunch of stuff. We are, other than a couple short, like a couple small little things, we are ready for drywall. Uh, just cleaning up the place. I got to pull a little bit of communication wire still and insulate the fireplace a little bit. And just a couple other tiny little odds and ends things that Literally going to take maybe a couple hours and we'll be done. So we have all the insulation in now. The plumbing is finished, if I haven't mentioned that before. Um, the house feels kind of like, you know, now that all the insulation's in, it feels enclosed. So it kind of feels like rooms. It's kind of cool. So, I mean, if you haven't seen any of this stuff before, this is going to be our pantry. Um... Hot water heater, water softener is going to be here. That's what this stuff's all for. Uh, kitchen. I got I to gotta pull like my can lights and all the light fixture or the outlets and stuff need to come out. Um, all the window jams are in. Everything has been insulated, like foamed. All the entire house, every... Uh, header and every top plate has been caulked at everything that took a while today um again door is done i gotta take the ceiling fan down but again everything's like i said everything is done finally bath or not bathroom the master bedroom Good lord, I can't talk. It's been a long day. Master closet. This is the master bedroom. And this, nothing's changed other than we got that done. The foaming around that's done. Uh, foaming's done. Uh, what else? Uh, I mean, basically just the same everywhere else. All this stuff's been caulked, all the foam around the windows is done, and it's all insulated. All of the other insulation's put in. This, underneath the hearth, is all packed full of insulation. Uh, eventually we'll have some vents and stuff that we need to move, So, but it, we can have drywall done for that, because like this one that was here is going to get moved over there. Um... Yeah, I just basically just showing around what this looks like now now that we're ready. Uh, I still need to put another piece of wood through here so that I can get that's for um towel rack, but I don't remember how big ours was, so I'm just gonna add another one there just to be safe, and then this insulation can go up. Uh that vent or the fart fan is what I call it. That's been in and done, insulated. Because I have to get a mechanical permit now. And that was a hold up that I found out last week. Which kind of ticked me off. But hey, it's no big deal I guess. If you, just a little bit more money of course. Um, yeah, this is a little closet right here. I don't need to insulate this one. It doesn't really need it. But again, closet, how it feels. Well, imagine that's enclosed obviously. But spare bedroom feels like an enclosed room now. Again, everything's been caulked. All the wires have been pushed up and out of the way. Harper's room well, feels enclosed. Windows and everything are done. Communication wires have been pulled. At least in this part of the stuff. I just have a little bit more to do and then that'll be done. Closet. Again, this was just for walking through because our drywall's in the way. So we'll, we already have the insulation right there. So that'll go up. <clears throat> and washer and dryer are going to go right there. And this will all be... Good to go. 
Uh, yeah. So our cabinets did come in. Uh, I'd show you, but they're all in boxes. And we opened them up. There was a couple broken ones, so we're, we're going to get them taken care of. But we wanted, like, a it's a knotty alder is what it's supposed to be. And it's just going to be an L-shaped kitchen. And, like, an island about right there. It turns out we looked at everything. We're like, this doesn't look like what we wanted. We wanted a knotty alder, so knots and stuff kind of everywhere. And it looked really, really nice in the store from some of the examples they showed us. Well, what we got was, like, there was, out of all the cabinets, there was maybe one or two tiny, tiny little knots. I'm going to say four or five total tiny little knots out of all of it. I'm like, that's not what I ordered. Long story short, they're working on things. Apparently, uh, from the manufacturer, they sent us the wrong ones. So, hoping and praying that is officially true. I mean, I, I, it sounds like that based on what we're getting from emails. But we're working through that one. And we're going to see when what's going to be up with that. So, but yeah, there you go. Yeah, quick little tour. Not really much to explain other than we're finally ready for drywall. I'm going to be getting my all of my inspections in. I got to file my, or get this. This permit needs to be turned in today or this week for a mechanical one because I have to get that. Um, plumbing one should be signed off. Electrical is already good to go. Have my building inspector come in this week and give me the good graces and then. I'll be contacting my drywallers probably today or tomorrow. And we're ready to go. So, it's been a long process. Everybody keeps asking me, well, when do you think you'll be done? If I had a freaking penny for every time I heard that thing, I swear, I would probably have this house paid off by now. Alrighty, I guess maybe next time you'll see drywall up. We'll see what the next update is.